The European Union has expressed its deep concern about the post-electoral violence in Chad and deplored the expulsion of many observers of the presidential elections four days after the announcement of the victory of Mohamed Idris, which was disputed by the opposition. General Mohamed Idris Deby Idno won 61.3% of the vote in the first round on May 6, according to provisional results. His main rival, Suisse Masra, who was officially credited with 18.53% of the vote, claimed that he had in fact won the election and asked the Constitutional Council to annul an election in which the results had been falsified. In this tense context, the European Union took note of the conduct of the first round of the elections and the publication of the provisional results. However, it expressed concerns about the electoral process, in particular the non-accreditation of a significant number of civil society observers. The EU underlined the importance of an inclusive, free, transparent, and peaceful electoral process to ensure the legitimacy of the results. The EU and Chad are long-standing partners in promoting stability and combating terrorism in the Sahel and Lake Chad regions and are committed to supporting all efforts by national, regional, and international actors to this end. It therefore expressed its concern at the post-election violence and called on all actors to use the means provided by the Constitution to resolve any disputes.